What's going on guys? It's Barona and my new toy is finally here. I got the hands-free Segway and I couldn't wait to bring you guys this video. I'm going to unbox it, show you guys how to ride it, tell you the price on it, and I'll put a link in the description on where to purchase one. Let's get right into it. Alright, so here's the nice box guys. Uh, this is what the Segway comes in. Uh, when it's shipped to your door, it'll actually be in another box wrapped around this one. Might even have like some kind of tape around it if it's coming from Hong Kong or something like that. Um, I do recommend to all you guys that you guys keep this box. It's very easy to travel with. It's great to have in your car. Keeps your Segway from rolling around in your car if you take it anywhere with you. That's just something I recommend to everybody. First, let's start off with opening the box. Sorry if it's a little shaky, guys. I'm trying to record with one hand and open the box with one hand. All right, so as you guys see, there's a manual here. I believe this tells you how to ride it and stuff. Just some basic information on the device itself. Here's the charger here. Uh, right there, it says red light will indicate when charging. Green light will indicate when it's full. Pull this off right here. Maybe. All right. All right, so as you guys see, there's a beautiful hands-free Segway. Let's go ahead and pull that out. Try to do this with one hand. Right. Oh man, that's heavy. It's about 22 pounds, I believe, is what it says on the box. All right, cut that out of here. One second, guys, I'll be right back. I'm gonna take this plastic off. All right, so as you guys can see now, the device is now out of the box. Um, I did go with the black color. You can choose from black, blue, red, or white. I like black just because it matches everything, and that's why I chose that color. Next, I want to get into how to power it on. Right here, you'll see this button to the left of the charger port. This is the charger port right here. Go ahead and power it on. Now that you see this green light pop up, that means it is powered on, and the battery is charged fully. If that ever starts beeping, that means your battery's dying, and they recommend that you plug it in when that happens, just because if you let it die all the way, you will kill the battery's lifespan. Uh, right here is the charger port. This takes about two and a half to three hours to fully charge, which is great, and these can go up to 12 to 13 miles on a full charge. All right, next I wanna show you guys how to get onto it. Do not try to balance on this. It will balance yourself. Take your right foot, balance it out, wait till the device is stopped and not moving. Take your left foot, get on. As you guys can see right now, the device itself is balancing me. To go forward, you want to lean both your feet forward. That takes you forward. To go backwards, you'll lean both your feet backwards. That takes you backwards. To turn left, you want to take your right foot point it down towards the ground and take your left heel and point it down towards the ground. As you can see, I'm turning. And then turn right. You'll do the same thing, but opposite. You'll take your right heel and push it down and take your left foot and push it forward. As you guys can see, I just turn that way. And that is how you do the turning. These things are not too hard to learn. It took me about 15 minutes. The hardest part is just getting on it and learning to let it balance you and not trying to balance on it. Um, I do not recommend taking these on pavements with cracks. Sometimes they tend to get stuck on the cracks and you will wreck, which will cause scratches along the sides of these. There is ways to prevent scratches also. I'll show you guys that in a later video. But that for the most part is how to ride the device. Um, now for a little bit of information on these. To get off, you'll wanna to come to a complete stop and step off the back like this. That's how you get off. Go ahead and get back on again. Balance it out. Get back on. All right guys, so that's how you ride it and that's kind of the basics. It takes a little bit to learn, like I said, but after you get the hang of it, it's super easy. All right, so now that you guys have seen the unboxing, got some information on the Segway itself, got some tips on how to ride it. I'd like to thank you guys for watching this video. I will be making more videos, so if you guys have any recommendations on a type of video you'd like to see, please leave a comment in the comment section below, and I'll do my best to put that out there for you guys. Also, drop a like. It'll be greatly appreciated. Um, like I said, I will put the link to this segue in the description. 
I did buy it off of Amazon.com for around 500 US dollars, but there is cheaper out there, and there's also some that go up to about $1,800. I believe that's the IOHawk brand. But before I do anything, I want to thank you guys again. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next video.